Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to exclude certain words from your searches. So let's begin. Let's say you have a shop where you sell basketballs or you want to start a shop where you're selling basketballs. So you're doing your search, you know, basic basketball. Okay, type it in and then you get your research. I mean you get your results. Here NBA, all this NBA stuff, Nike.com, NBA. Now let's say we don't want any results that has NBA in it. So you just hit a space, hit the minus bar, and then, oh, I'm sorry, the minus key, and then hit NBA, and then hit return, or go. And as you can see, there's no NBA results on this page. So as you can see, you can exclude certain terms. And I'll give you another example. Let's say black shoes okay so we have black shoes and we come on down here we are black shoes women's diaries athletic shoes so let's go ahead and minus athletic because we don't want any results we don't want to waste time athletic so then we hit go and let's keep an eye right here too and see what our results come up with so minus athletic and see it went down 153,000, 153 million results. It's, and there you go. So as you can see there's many um, filters as I like to call them that you can exclude from your search. So you can just pick anything. Let's see. Anything, anything, anything. You can see that I have diaries. Black Shoe Diaries. I've never heard that before. So let's type in diaries. I'm not sure what that will come up with. So D A I R I E S. So minus diaries. And our count goes back up. You can see that. But we don't have any black shoe diaries anymore. And you can just keep doing this all day long. Black shoe shop. And our total went down significantly and you can see all the results for black shoes without shopping it so that's how you filter your searches when you want to exclude certain words from the searches that you are searching for so I'll see you guys in the next video where we're going to continue with our search techniques